Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and it's time for another Ipsy unboxing. And I've totally already peeked at this, looked through all of it, uh, but just because <laughs> it came last weekend um, and I just haven't had a chance yet to film it. So I was pretty excited and went through it anyways. Sorry. <laughs> um, so we have the little baggie in here and it's kind of cute. Kind of makes me think of old Hollywood. Um, just because of all the sunglasses and what was it, an Andy Warhol painting? It's kind of what makes me think of it. It was an Andy Warhol painting of Marilyn Monroe that he did with all the different colors and all the different frames. And that's just kind of what this makes me think of. So, first thing I pull out of here is a Mitchell in Peach English Growers English Leaf Body Cream. Now, I have already tried this and... I really don't care for it. It is very rich and creamy, so on that aspect, I like it, but I don't care for the smell. But I'm not the biggest fan of florals. Um, and it says back here, it's blended with a bright green floral scent. So, there you go. Um, so this is probably going to be going in one of my makeup declutter videos, even though it's a body cream, uh, just because I'm probably not going to use it. Like I said, I tried it that one time. And it's really rich and creamy, so I like that part of it. Not a big fan of the smell. So let's go ahead and see what's in the bag. Um, first thing in here is from Pure Lease, and it's a Blue Lotus 4-in-1 Eye Adore Serum for intensive hydration, uh, firms and brightens, decreases puffiness for all skin types. So that's pretty cool. And we've gotten some stuff from Pure Lease before that I really enjoy. They sent out an under eye lightening cream, which I love. I love using that after I use like a really dark black eyeliner. You know, sometimes you'll get a little bit of fallout or it'll stain the underside of your eyes a little bit. The one they sent out is fantastic to just put on before bed. And when you wake up, you still have like bright eyes instead of having like stained under eyes that eyeliner can cause. So I'm excited to give that guy a go. The next one in here is I think it's an eyeliner yeah it's from Mr. Right Now it's from The Balm which The Balm Cosmetics is pretty good I've gotten a few other samples from them that I really really love I have a eyeshadow and what was it it was a sample of a liquid lipstick and I really like both of those so this eyeliner even though it's a brown I'm probably really going to like it. Right now I'm trying to get the little tab off. Okay, well I am just completely failing and breaking the seal on this guy. But it's a lip liner from the Balm Cosmetics. They're really good. If you're interested, go look at pretty much anybody else's Ipsy bag from this month. Because I've seen several people get this. And they've been able to open it. Though they did have some struggle. They were able to open it <laughs> and swatch this for their videos. So if you're really interested, I'd suggest go check it out. One of the other YouTubers that subscribed to Ipsy who was able to open this and swatch it. But this is taking me too long and it's really jacking up the rhinestones on my fingernails there. So uh, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna put this guy away for right now and I'll come back to him later when I, maybe I've got like a pair of scissors or tweezers or something. This next thing in here is from Peak and it is a a natural stain brow powder so it's kind of a cute little package right here it's all like pink on one side and it's brown on the other and it kind of slides open it reminds me of pill boxes um, yeah you can get pill boxes where like you put your little pills inside and you just, you just slide it shut you put it in your purse and this is what the color is and I'm guessing that's gonna work pretty good for my brows I don't know when I'll get around to trying it, though, I'm pretty attached to my Ipsy brow powder. Like, this is going to be have to be some amazing stuff for me to want to trade out my Ipsy brow stuff. But I'll give it a go, and we'll see. Then there's one last thing down in here, and it is an eyeshadow trio from City Color. And City Color is actually um, the cosmetic brand that has my lipstick that I have on today. But uh, I think I've gotten a couple of things from them before. I really like my lipstick. <laughs> Let's hope their eyeshadow is just as awesome. So this is what the eyeshadow looks like. If I can get it open here. 
Okay, so here's the front of the City Cosmetics eyeshadow, and then we open it up, and that's what all the colors look like. So let's give a little swatch here. Oh, these are pretty pigmented. Uh, definitely a buttery type of powder, I would say. You can see them right there. They're really nice. I like those. Those are going to be fun to play with. I'm really excited about that red-brown color. I think that's gorgeous. So that's everything I got in my Ipsy bag this month. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Subscribe if you've not already, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.